Everybody. welcome back or welcome if you're new today we're gonna finally put up the tree Bo had been after me for a few days and so even though I normally wouldn't do this until after Thanksgiving I decided to go ahead and put it together with him we were tickled because this is the first year that we bought a tree that's pre-lit and so for anybody who knows anything about putting trees together the lights are the most time consuming and headache part of decorating and also undecorating the Christmas tree so we were really excited that this one is pre-lit and also all the limbs were hinged already onto the tree so we didn't have to sit there and put each branch on individually like we have had to do in years past so let me warn you that this will not be your typical Christmas decorate with me because I don't decorate the entire house. I only decorate the front room and a couple of things on the windowsill in the kitchen, maybe on the counter, but I do not decorate bedrooms or bathrooms or laundry room or any of that kind of thing. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, I would love you to join our little community here and so hit that subscribe button and there's a notification bell that will let you know every time I have a new upload. Making our Christmas memories. I've been working so much lately. I can barely find the time to sleep. Yeah, I spend my time running around, keeping people pleased. But this is my favorite holiday. It's a chance to start over new. Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you. These are the good times with you. Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me. Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh And I've been longing to hold you close Forget about everyone else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories Come back home to me And when we wake up in the morning I'm gonna play those carols that you love We'll be singing all the melodies Until the sun comes up These are the good times with you Baby, this year It's just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it is? Christmas memories, oh, and I've been longing to hold you close, forget about everyone else, isn't this how it's supposed to be, making our Christmas memories, oh, oh, la da 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 oh, 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 oh,
keep that buffalo check tree skirt that I found at Goodwill last year. I really like it, but there's nothing behind it to keep it standing up. So I would have to have something in there. Otherwise it, you know, it's just open on the inside. I told him I could just maybe stuff some blankets behind it to keep it standing up, but he preferred the look of the tree skirt, which I do like my tree skirt as well, but I really like the look of the buffalo check because a lot of my ornaments have that buffalo check on it. We went ahead and and switched it out to the skirt which you'll see later and maybe next year I can figure out a solution to use this one instead it's cold outside but the fire keeps us warm we can spend the night underneath the mistletoe and I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree tomorrow it is Christmas Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I've longed for this moment to have you for myself. In a cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else. I've decorated everything to be perfect for this week. Tomorrow. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else. I've decorated everything to be perfect for this week. Tomorrow.
we had the hardest time getting that star up there. I don't know why the tops of trees are made so flimsy. This one does have a sturdier piece on top for the tree topper and it did state that on the box but I guess because the you know the piece of the tree topper that sticks down over the top of the tree it's so long that it still makes the star wobbly up there so it's a little crooked and all that but it we finally got it up there and it's it's up there <laughs> And I had plans for when I was going to do this decorating. I knew I wanted to film it. And so in my head, I was going to do it in a slow and leisurely and organized fashion. I wanted to go through my boxes of ornaments to see what I had and what I needed. Because like I said in my last video, I think, I forgot that I even threw away my Christmas tree last year. And so I had to um, quickly go out and buy this one, which it's small smaller than our other one. I am kind of like a kid when it comes to Christmas and the bigger and fuller the tree the better but I had to buy what I could afford and as far as decorations go I forgot I apparently also threw away or I might have brought it to Goodwill but I'm not sure all of my Christmas balls which I'm okay with not putting the balls on the tree. Poor Bo is about to struggle with this snowman and I don't know why. Well, I do know why, but my camera ended up dying. So I didn't even get to catch him getting it onto the, the mirror. So I threw up a picture of what it looked like afterwards. Oh, so I just do this? You can try that. It might work. Put the whole thing on and then carefully peel off the front. He pulled it down before we realized that it wasn't going to work anyway and I got so frustrated. Um, I wanted to leave a lot of this audio in just like when we were decorating the tree and stuff but we had a movie playing in the background and it was so loud cut out all of the audio or most of the audio sadly so here I am getting all of my Christmas dishes loaded into the dishwasher to finish making a load it wasn't full enough and so i was like oh well good now i can stick all this in there and get that washed so i do wash them obviously after being put up all year and then i take down my regular coffee cups and put up my christmas coffee cups and then at the end of christmas vice versa i take down all of the christmas coffee cups and pack them back up for the year and put my regular ones back out the night before Christmas I was closing down for business in my little prison shop when the bell on the door jingled once more and then time almost came to a stop but somehow I knew, and maybe so did you, that everything would change from now on. Yes, from this Christmas on, from this Christmas on.
Yes, I have a lot. I've just accumulated these over the years. Some of them, some of them work better than others as far as drying. Some are just pretty. So I'm trying to kind of separate. <laughs> I was going to leave in this audio, but the camera leaves such a weird background noise. And I took, I used the noise reduction tool and it's just, it's the camera. It almost sounds like I'm outside at night with the crickets and mosquitoes. I don't know. <laughs> so I'll just, I guess, talk over it. Here I'm doing the same thing as I did with the dishes. I washed all of these dish towels and pot holders and so i'm putting out the christmas ones and putting up the non-christmas ones and then after christmas i'll switch them back out and go back to normal um i think i had started saying or i had talked about in my last video how by the time christmas comes around i'm done with all that and i already know that that's how it's going to be again this year um i look so forward to the holidays but then once they're here and you get through them it's like uh, okay it's time for the new year start over or start fresh put all that holiday mess away and get back to normal life and then by like july it's like oh there's only six more months till christmas and then yeah, it's the same pattern. It's a cycle. Um, and I think I've done this the majority of my adult life. But that's okay. Um, holidays are still good. I'm not opposed to holidays. Um, Jesus is the reason for the season anyway. And um, for me, I can't speak for anybody else, but for me, what I like about the holidays is the family get-togethers. So... And that can be done any time of year, but it's just special at holiday times. It's the same thing with food. Like our family, we have a traditional, what I would say, Thanksgiving meal. We have the turkey, we have the ham. Now, we live here in South Louisiana, so when we can, we may have a goose instead of a turkey or duck, you know, but... um anyway we have that meat and then we'll have our cornbread dressing we do not stuff the bird but we have cornbread dressing green bean casserole you know the traditional stuff then we have mexican cornbread we have rolls um sometimes there are other sides like this year i will do the um, Pioneer Woman's Soul Sweet Taters. And then I'm also going to do, and this is new for our family, but I'm going to do a hash brown casserole. And then for our desserts, we usually have pecan pie, lemon meringue pies, um, pumpkin sometimes, or sweet potato. You know, all the traditional stuff. Um some families don't do that and we do and every year we're like why do we only eat these foods once a year or twice a year because we do it for Christmas as well as Thanksgiving and then on New Year's we'll have 
uh, a pork roast, um, cabbage, black eyes, those traditional New Year's foods. And um, we always say, why do we only eat this, you know, at the holiday time? But we're all in agreement that if we would eat these things throughout the year, then they wouldn't have that special meaning as they do now that we only save them for the holidays. Now, yes, periodically throughout the year, I'll cook a ham. Um, and there have been times that in the middle of the year, I decided I was hungry for some um, cornbread dressing, but it's very rare. So anyway, I didn't realize, but I lost a big chunk of footage here. Why well, I didn't lose it, I never had it. <laughs> I was doing a lot of stuff, taking a lot of the ornaments and things out of the boxes like I had originally planned to do on the day that we put up the tree because this is obviously a different day. Um, but I thought the camera was recording for a, a lot of it and it wasn't. So whatever, you didn't miss much. You can see it all laid out there on the table and um, it's still there on the table and here we are a couple more days later. I just don't feel like messing with it. Um, I have a few outside ornaments that I'll let the kids go out there and do. Um, I still, well, I hung my wreath out on one door, but I want to move it from that door to another door. And um, really, that's about it. Some of the stuff that's on the table needs to go back into the boxes because I'm not going to use it. And then I need to put all those boxes back over there in that extra bedroom and um, that's where they will sit until Christmas is over and then I'm gonna have to get on my husband to be sure he puts them up because they actually never got brought back to the attic after last Christmas they sat in that bedroom the entire year and um, yeah no we're not doing that again this year so as soon as everything comes down I need to push those totes right out the door so that he can get out there and put them up in the attic for me. So we're coming to the end of this video, y'all. And um, as you can see, like I said, I don't do much in the way of decorating. It's all kind of just right here. And um, eh, it's good enough for us. So, you know, um, my kids like it. They don't complain and um, just is what it is. So, Anyway, if you like this video um, and you are new here, go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell. Um, if you're not new, thank you for returning. Um, I like to see the familiar names in the comments and interacting in the comments does help my channel. So please leave a comment. Um, let me know what your family's um, holiday traditions are and let me know where you're watching from. Um, I'm down here in southwest Louisiana. We finally have some winter weather. It's like in the 40s. Um, I guess you could say we have some sweater weather, but um, it won't stick around for long. So I'm enjoying it while I can. I look forward to seeing you in the comments. Bye. Doesn't matter, it is Christmas in my heart. Here we go. All right. Dance, dance, now this Christmas, we're going to dance. We're going to okay. dance, 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 dance. Come on. Dance. We're going to dance, dance, dance. Have a good time. Dance, dance, All night long, we're going to dance, dance, dance. And have a good time. I think Santa's going to come and join us in this song. Oh, yeah.